Hello everybody, welcome to Coastal Crafts. Hello and welcome to Coastal Crafts. So I'm back doing a drawing for the little mini giveaway that I did with my um, Simply Cars and Papercraft magazine haul. Um, so just put for the names in here, I'm not going to drag it out. Do love this mug though, picked that one up in New York from Starbucks. And we'll read a name out, it's all very old school here. So let's see, who have we got? So Stephen Barry, um, all you need to do is, um, I leave my email address in the um, description box below. So all you need to do is send me an email with your address and I will pop that in the post to you. So thank you very much to everyone who entered. Shall tidy that up in a minute. I'm also gonna show you some lovely happy mail that I got from the lovely Lois. So bring this over here. So Lois and I um, do regular happy mail swaps. And with my pocket letter, she always pops in a little goodie, little goodie pocket, which I've opened up already and it had some goodies in. So she put me in some lovely um, sentiment stickers. Those are always useful. Look at this gorgeous ribbon. Let's try and open it up. Almost reminds me of like um, 1920s sort of style. It's pretty, isn't it? Um, some felt and stiff felt so that should die cut really nicely so that'd be very useful um, lovely embossing folder have actually got this one already so I can um, send this one on which is always nice sent me some these look like the hunky dory sheets and I do love those hunky dory sheets as we know it's a really cute one so I'll be using those a lovely stencil be handy some cute little stickers um, and then this is the gorgeous pocket letter. And there was a card as well, but I realised I put that up downstairs because it was so pretty. And um, there was another one, I think there were another two of these um, stuck on the edges, but they seem to have fallen off. Because you know what it's like when it goes through the postal service. It's asking quite a lot. But nature was our theme and I do love anything sort of pretty and floral and all of those natural things. So I have a quick look and see what you popped inside. Some really cute wooden embellishments. And it's all sparkly too. Um, some lovely bows. Some more sentiments. Those are always really handy for doing card making, which I do like to do. Some letter um, beads. Some really pretty resin flowers. So what happens when it goes, I was speaking to the post, um, the guy in the post office today and he was sort of saying about, you know, they, they worry about squashing things, they don't, and upsetting people by squashing the packages. And I was like, well, I'm fairly aware that people do squash it. Oh, the post-it notes. That's cute, isn't it? The, 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 you know, even if it doesn't get squashed in the post office, it probably does get squashed somewhere down the line through the postal service. We know that happens. Where did I get to? down here gorgeous gorgeous girls ribbon so that's gorgeous girls as well we know that i love my gorgeous girls don't we <laughs> um some pearls and actually white pearls are probably the ones i use the most I do have to say they go with most things and most things and let's have a look at these what are these little ones let's try and turn it over oh so they're like little sparkly gems and those are cute beads. So thank you so much, Lois. That's absolutely beautiful. And look at that flower on there and the cute little tag she's made. The colour scheme is really lovely. And I shall put this on oh, that washi tape's lovely too, isn't it? There goes my little swan who was watching. Oh no. Um, so this goes inside one of my folders where I keep all my lovely pocket letters so I can look back on them and remember them. Um, if you're interested in doing swaps for 2020, contact me as well on the email. As I say, the email address is below. And yeah, otherwise I shall see you in my next video. Bye.